mind. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> he yeah, just yeah. doesn't use it in a tournament. But it's legit. Actually, actually he has a secondary fox though. Like he he always like wants to play his secondary fox, and uh, he wants to beat Pro Smasher Tim, the crew leader, with his secondary fox. He never did though. And they strike to FD. Weird choice, if you ask me. Yeah, very strange. But Uzleon is a man of mystery. Yes, indeed. Oh, nice power shield grab right there on the laser. Wow. Just tech chasing going. You gotta. Oh my god, this is so funny. So I just realized something. Whenever Uzleon goes for a tech chase re grab, yeah. his eyes will open up so much more. You gotta stare at the screen yeah, know, to he, see if it's a tech He place. does a really, really like sick scare. He looks amazingly scary. But he does the tech chases, so please keep that in mind, guys. Look at Uzleon's face the next time he tries to go for a down throw regrab. Yeah, and you saw that uh, weird shield grab attempt that Uzleon just missed. That's uh, missed input um, uh, near out of shield. Yeah, I definitely know it's that. It's the same as well. same exact buttons. So if you just do it with the wrong timing, you will get a shield grab instead of the neutral air out of shield. I have that so often. Uzleon evens out the stocks without getting too much damage. So now we could potentially see some more attack chases. So I really want to see Uzleon uh, Uzle watch the player cam. It's going to be funny. Here we go. Opportunity. <laughs> there, the eyebrows. The get up attack. Forward tilt, though. Way too early to actually be using that for a tech chase. But gets away with it. Might just pick up the stock. Ledge uh -oh. take from Timmy. Instant side B. Barely clips Uzleon and he takes uh, center stage again. But. This is a big opportunity wow, for him. Wow, that punish! Good ledge dash from Usleon to get back in, but Timmy's still keeping on the pressure right now. Trying to find a dash attack. Knows that a dash attack that hits successfully on this stage can be really, really juicy for Sheik. Forward tilt, down tilt. Free ledge, though. Tried to clip him with the needles with whatever was coming at him, but the uh, illusion is just a little bit too quick. It's not an illusion, right? It's a fa phantasm. 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 Yeah. Fox illusion, Falco phantasm. All right, I see. Oh. Is not getting it now? Ah, the, the eyebrows again. I, it's so fu I cannot look away from this anymore. <laughs> it's so funny. Oh, oh no. Another bold strategy. We saw Glory. Yeah. Make oh. actually Grace and Timmy flip. dies and for it! That Timmy. is the best transformation I've ever seen in my life. Oh my god. So I think more, more Sheiks that play yeah. against Timmy should pick up this yeah. bold strategy. It seems to be working out. Yeah. Like two of two out of two now, right? Yeah. So let's go. Transforming like, into Zelda. Yeah. Sheik's uh, down B, best down B in the game. Yeah, possibly. <laughs> that stomp though will put Timmy in the lead. Full stock oh no. up the here. Eyebrows. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> this is so funny. <laughs> Trying to close, wave dashing in with the shield there. This might just be it. Yeah. It's gonna be the stop. Wow, Uzleon. Nice job tying it up. Both of these players vying for a chance to uh, get a rematch against Ice. Oh! That charge F smash, wow. and it looked like Uzgon was actually trying to space around it, but he was just a bit too careless, so like slightly further to the left, and that F smash would have not uh, connected. Good stuff to Timmy for going for a ballsy option and making it work, though. Yeah, that kick to the face definitely looked brutal. It, it looked like you know her head would explode off yeah. her uh, off her body from from a kick like that. Also made the same sound. Dash attack here. Timmy, normally you don't want to be dash attacking at low percent, but when your opponent is in the air, it's actually not that bad of an op option. And that uh, catches the tech in place here. Not the second time, though. It's just the crucial for Sheik to get Falco above 40%, where you start like unlocking your, uh, your uh, bread and butter moves. Yeah, Suddenly, the dash attack, for instance, which is very important in the neutral, um, will suddenly yield results instead of just get you crouch cancel shined. Uh, so, Nick, yep. as a Sheik man yourself, yep. what do you think about that counter pick? Going to Dreamland? Yeah. Um, Dreamland, 
in this matchup, I feel like a lot of a lot of uh, the stages just come down to uh, which one fits the other's playstyle more than the actual character, because you know, like as Sheik, typically you want you like Dreamland, typically you, you like Battlefield, you like Yoshi's, and you like Fountain, and all of them can be terrible against the right kind of Falco. That's you know. So if he's comfortable with Falco's laser game, then Dreamland is pretty good for Sheik because it increases your, your survivability, it gives you a lot of options in the recovery, it lives, gives you a lot of options in moving around the laser. And uh, at the same time, if uh, Falco is just really good at just uh, keeping his space and uh, keeping the gun in your face, then Drainland might not be the best option. But thus far, it's, uh, it's playing out quite even. I think the only one where you can give like a, a clear advantage to either player is Pokemon. Like, yeah. Close is FD, but also on FD, Sheik has some stuff against Falco. Yeah. Where uh, a dash attack, for instance, is a, is a much more rewarding on FD than most other stages because there's no chance of a platform coming in yeah. and interrupting your, your follow up. That's true, that's true. So, yeah, Uzleon opting for, I guess, the right stage because he is a very movement heavy player, so I guess he should be rather fine with Timmy's laser game and yeah. uh, should be able to play around that and we see that as well like Timmy doesn't get too much out of that he even got more out of the laser game on FD if you ask me who so connects with the sour back here though uh, this now he cleans it up he gets the, the sweet spot with the, with the karate kicks there but yeah as you can tell um, Uzleon doesn't seem too faced by, uh, by uh, Timmy's laser game just opting to, uh, to take a uh, top platform there and making uh, Timmy chase him. And uh, hasn't always been winning those situations though, where he is making Timmy uh, like uh, approach him. But at the same time, at least you're not uh, playing into his hand. You're making Timmy do what you want to, him to do, yeah. rather than him making you do what he wants you to do. Good grab there. Neutral air will set him flying. Not quite going to be enough yet, though. Nice delay on that upbeat. Aimed it a little high on the ledge. And that forward tilt was really scary because crouch cancel is still in play for yeah. Timmy. All right, so is Timmy going to be up 2 0 or is, is Uzlian going to be able to gimp him for once so he actually can even out the. Oh, 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 oh no, 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 no. Timmy, too slow to get to the ledge. Yeah, that was, uh, that was a very, very bold mind game there by Uzlian. Oh, he could have committed there and got for the back air. Uh, he wasn't too sure because it's his last stock, right? Yeah. So he'd rather keep center stage. Down throw. Still going for the tech chase. And again, he can still. Crouch cancel that. I think if he connected with the hard dash attack, he wouldn't have been able to successfully crouch cancel. But since he got hit by the weak part of the dash attack, it still worked at 50%. Yeah. That's going to be it. Two stock victory for Timmy and uh, tournament match for Uzdeon here. Wow. <laughs> Timmy was aggressively waving through his hair. Was like, yeah. let's do this. Let's do it. You never see Timmy like that, though. Like, he's a very, very calm and collected guy. Yeah. yeah. Except for when he's drunk. He's super funny when he's drunk. Yeah? yeah. I haven't seen him drunk. He's a very funny person in general, but yeah. uh, he never got to see it because he's very calm, right? Yeah. Let's see here. Who's on? Taking him back to Dreamland. Feels like the stage wasn't the problem there. To be fair, he did have some openings. He didn't always make the most of them, so it's fair enough. Just go back. Stick with the game plan. I, would, I think uh, I would like to see Uzlian up for close corners, but then again, uh, something like Fountain could backfire because he, like his movement is one of his biggest assets, so why give up on the movement if you have less space to move Exactly. Right? And also with Fountain, you'll more often be put in edge guard or recovery situations. Yeah. And, and you don't want to be recovering yeah. against Falco because he can mess you up really hard. I guess you don't want to be recovering with Sheik in general too much, Michelle, yeah. because like she, it's so easy to punish her recovery. Exactly. Well, uh, we again, see. Timmy taking the lead. Uh, Timmy playing.
keeping it very safe, playing around Uzleon. Whenever Uzleon tries to go for the center stage, because Timmy is staying outside on purpose just to, uh, you know, keep him out himself. Whenever we see Uzleon then reach center stage and uh, push Timmy uh, further outside, he just moves to the top platform. This should be. Oh, it's not. Uzleon could have fast forward to the ledge in some back air. Could yeah. have been the stock, but. Um, seemed to expect uh, Timmy to just plummet to his death there, so... No, it just a, a little more recovery than Uslian thought. Yeah, he just a small miscalculation. Roll from the ledge, Falco can cover that. Oh, Timmy jumped a little bit too early on the second jump there. That was very unfortunate for him because he could have taken that stock. And Uslian keeps connecting his dash attack with the sour spot, and not with the, mm. the juicy uh, combo hit. Could he still get the combo hit at 107? Like, could he still combo? Probably not, but you'll still be in a better position than when you hit that sour thing that just makes him, like, fall to the ground away from you, you know? That's true, that's true. Yeah, not a very good uh, move for follow-ups, but keeps it within one stock, one juicy tech chase away. Yeah. Man, Uslion is looking uh, is looking to fall apart in that set against Timmy. Like we usually see, like you know, the the thing is, whenever they play, yeah, right. Yeah. When Timmy wins, it's 3-0. Yeah. When Uslion wins, it's 3-2. Yeah. Every single time. So but I could tell. The last time I saw Uslion beat Timmy, Timmy was also up 2-0, and he made the reverse 3-2. Yeah. So. It's not like they went back and forth. There was still a 3-0 in there. It was just in the context of being down 0-2. <laughs> exactly, exactly. So, if Uzleon clutches this game, then we he's going to win the set. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, you know, we can expect uh, Timmy to win two games in every set they play. <laughs> <laughs> Tried to commit uh, to covering that side B. Timmy wisely just uh, DI'd super far out. So who's going to get his revenge Ooh. against Ice, his shot at revenge against Ice? It, all all the fingers are pointing towards Timmy right now. Yeah. All the stars are aligned for the Austrian tournament stock for Uzleon here. But you know, Sheik has some nasty gimps. Though Timmy is a player who will not go to your side of the stage if he doesn't have to. Yeah. And he still has 4 minutes and 18 seconds left on the clock that, uh, that Uzleon has to even out, you know. Uzleon is, is the one who has to even out the situation. <laughs> Another down questionable down smash, yeah. edge smash. Uzleon, are you going to make it back from this? Oh my oh, goodness, the air. edge cancel neutral air to back air. That was insane. Yeah. Timmy with a Three. very, very oh. solid finish. 3 0 Uzleon, making it to grand finals against Ice. Man, I'm done thinking sitting somewhere in that in that room in some corner and thinking like this is what I lost for. Like <laughs> I would have whipped Timmy. I'm pretty sure that Dunning is a little bit salty about that. Wow. Well, good stuff to Uzleon anyway, getting third place at a national as the TO. It's crazy, right? Yeah. I not think, bad at all. I think the same thing I think it happens every time when he TOs. I think he